Hi guys, today we're going to talk about the uh, lawsuit that Prince Harry logged against the uh, Mirror Group. This is related to the phone hacking scandal that happened back in the day and that he is suing for now. A few things have transpired today, which is the second day of the uh, trial. So what we hear is that the Mirror has apologized to Prince Harry for having unlawfully collected data about his private life. They refute the idea that they bugged his phone to get information, but they admit that they collected information illegally. So they are not only apologizing for it, but they are suggesting a compensation. But Prince Harry doesn't want compensation. He wants to see it through. And also we hear that the mirror in his defense of having obtained illegal information says that some of the information were not obtained illegally. They were given to them by a member of the royal family. They are actually saying that Mark Boland, who used to be the private secretary of Prince Charles at the time, gave the information to Peace Morgan, who he was a good friend of. Yes, they're saying that Prince Charles, private secretary, gave this information to Peace Morgan, who was working as a teacher in chief. Of, of the newspaper. And they're saying that, listen, it's not us. It's Peace Morgan who got the information from Prince Charles' office. So it's really interesting. I'm going to put a link in the description, a link to an article in The Guardian that will give you a recap of everything that's happening in court. It's super serious. And the fact that they're actually apologizing to Prince Harry is enormous. The funny thing is, none of the tabloids who are always reporting on Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have reported that. You can only read this in big newspapers that are non-tabloid, you see. Again, I'm going to put that as a first comment and also in the description of the video. It's a great article. I mean, it's a collection of trial summaries. And also something quite interesting is that Omid Scobi used to work as an intern for Peace Morgan at the newspaper, and he said that he heard Prince Morgan discuss about some phones conversation that, that were obtained illegally, right? And he said that he heard Prince Morgan repeat it over the phone, repeat the fact that these were voice messages, allegedly. So it's quite interesting. Let me know what you think. Hope you like the video. Feel free to click on like if it's the case. Subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell to be notified when I post.